Oh, yeah. A bald guy with a big spider drawn on his head. Really? <laughs> I'll tell you more if you play with us. I love some children who are well-versed in the art of extortion. Hello and welcome back to this Let's Play of Shenmue 3. In the last episode, we found the guy with the scar, this guy, and we had to beat him up. I wasn't very good at beating him up, so I had to go train. So in this episode, we need to go and find the flower sun moon guy. Hold on. Flower sun moon guy. Can we just go to like, um, uh, the thugs had it in for bookie of flower bird wind and moon guy. Find flower bird wind and moon bookie. I assume he's with like all the other bookies, yeah. I won't be worth anything if I don't eat. So he's going on about eating. We need to make some money at some point because I'm gonna run out of money. So this is the flower, wind, and moon stall. But he's not there. We ask, does this guy know? Excuse me. Hello there. Would you like to play some dice? No, thank you. The rules are simple. Roll a bigger number than me, and you win. That sounds helpful. I need your help with something. I'd like to talk to the flower, bird, wind, and moon bookie. He's not here yet. Where is he? He usually opens up shop at 7 p.m. 7 p.m. Got it. Thanks a lot. I'll have to wait till seven. Uh, go to the dude at seven. Can we wait? To Joy Park at seven? Yeah, cool. I do like this, so you don't have to like waste much time. You can come back at seven. This is pretty, I like the fire. I better eat something before I fall over. Excuse me. Hey there! Try your hand at Flower Bird Wind and Moon. I've got no tokens. Oh, I do have got two hundred coins. Ooh, two hundred coins. Tokens. I was about to say coins, oh, it's tokens. Why so serious, buddy? Why so serious? <laughs> I hear those thugs cause some trouble. You're telling me. It was awful. What happened? I'll tell you all about it if you play around. Okay. You gotta win naturally. <laughs> <laughs> I should have saved beforehand. Have to collect your bed in advance. Um, just fifteen will do. All right. Which do you bet on, flower, bird, <laughs> wind, or moon? So I always bet moon. I don't know if it's like a superstition, but I always bet moon. Coming in. And I, I don't know why. It's always been moon. You can go to like a fortune teller, and they can tell you what color is your lucky color, and. Usually that's what colour you'll win the most on here. Oh, 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 ah, wind. We're gonna lose all our tokens, aren't we? Win. Well. Too bad. That one goes to me. Up for another? Well, I have to, because I need to win, don't I? I'll have to collect your bed in advance. I bet you do. I could go right. running off with it. Which do you bet on? Flower, bird, wind, or moon? It's always moon, I'm sorry. This one. You're probably like, nah, you should go wind or bird. No one will go flower. Who goes flower? Let me know in the comments which one you're going for. I forever will go moon. Come on, moon. 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 <laughs> Uh, good times, good times. Didn't cost me too much then. Oh, it looks like you've beaten me. Now give me the information, thug. Ooh. Things are just heating up. What happened with the thugs? They came in here, busted everything up, and stole my money. I've lost a fortune. That shame. I'll make this right. I promise. Tell me more. All right, might as well. <laughs> Two of them came here. <laughs> One was a 
big, long-haired guy. The other had his head shaved, head showing shaved. off his spider tattoo. Spider tattoo. A big, long-haired guy and a bald man with a spider tattoo on his head. Got it. Got but it. He kept threatening me, asking where the stonemason lives. <laughs> I Why would he know? Told him to have a look this guy doesn't look tough. So buzz off. Looks like his name would be Randall or something. <laughs> so that's how they found Joe and Wong's houses. Then they came back to yell at me because no. they didn't find who they wanted. Not his fault. I handed over some money and they let me go, saying something about the Sunflower Grove. The Sunflower Grove. Got it. Thanks. That's a huge help. It's gotten so dark. Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. <laughs> I love this game. Uh, to Shenhua's house. It just makes me laugh so much. Just. You would have thought the modern, the modern retelling, 18 years on, the story writing would be better. <laughs> Not better, because I think this is gold. However, it would be... Mm, I don't know the word. Hey, Xinhua. What is it, Leon? <laughs> Not as hey, funny as it is. Grove. I heard that's where the thugs went. Are you serious? If you find them... Then you should be able to find out where my father is. Where is my father? That's the plan. Don't worry. I'll find them. Thank you so much. You're welcome. What's the Sunflower Grove like? It's jam-packed with sunflowers for starters. Duh. It's quiet out there. Just flowers and some old ladies raising cattle. Aww. That sounds nice. It does. Kids like to play around there, though, so it can get a bit loud. Ew. I hope they don't get mixed up with those thugs. Me too. I mean, are thugs really gonna like try and hurt I really children? Find those thugs tomorrow. Guess they might, but Me too. before they bother any of the kids. Agreed. Please be careful, okay? For the kids. Okay. Let's go to bed. Do a safey save. Saving. Go to sleep. In the morning, we're gonna find some sunflowers. It's awake time. Uh, check out the sunflower grove. Let's go. Was there any really, like anything more that I missed with the bookie? Um, flower blah blah. Back at seven. Talk to flower bird, wind and moon bookie. When it gets to him to get information, the thugs persistently asked uh, asked Song about the stonemason's house. So he randomly told them the village square. They didn't find it and took it down on Song. The thugs went from the village square to the sunflower grove. Check out the sunflower grove. Okay, we can check out the sunflower grove. Right. Let's go. Shem, why are you going to say goodbye to us? Isn't that nice? Yeah. Hmm? See you later. Bye, Shemwa. Yeah. See you soon. See you soon, Shemwa. <laughs> Uh, village square. Let's not waste that energy. Do 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 do. You talk to that guy. No. <laughs> I'm gonna talk to her. See if she Excuse knows about something. Well, what is it? She's always been very helpful. Which way is it to the Sunflower Grove? Oh, what do we have here? Are you and Shen Hua on a date? Although very annoying. Well. Oh dear. There I go running my mouth again. <laughs> She's so annoying. The Sunflower Grove is up on the hill. Thank you. Thanks.
Uh, how to get to the sunflower grows up on the hill. Go out and see if the old man knows about it. Excuse me. I need to get to the sunflower grove. Let your feet guide you. Thank you, sir. Right. Take the right up ahead. Got it. Thanks a lot. And right. Right at the fork at the bell tower. This is left. Why are you going left? Because I want to speak to this woman. Hi there. I like her. Ah, young boy. Deal, was it? I don't think we ever got introduced, but okay. Yes, that's right. Shenhua doesn't seem to be with you today. How do you know? <laughs> I can just tell. Do you have a moment? She's just gonna ignore you. Kind of rude. Spiritual ladies are always kind of rude. <laughs> what is it? Oh, she's actually gonna. I'll come back. Oh. I'm just gonna ignore her then. We'll go right like the nice old man said. Look how pretty this is. I guess we're going right again. I already see the sunflowers, so. Oh, well, there's children playing. Hi, kids. Can I play too? <laughs> I don't know why they all look like Sim children. Play with us. Sorry, I'm Why won't you play with us? Be busy later. Come on, play hide and seek with us. <laughs> oh, child. There's someone else I have to find right now. Play hide and seek, and we'll tell you anything you want. Can you tell me? Have you seen any thugs around here? What do you mean? Have you seen anyone you don't know? <laughs> yeah, you. Oh, yeah. A bald guy with a big spider john on his head. Really? <laughs> I'll tell you more if you play with us. I love some you... children who are well versed in the art of extortion. <laughs> okay, there's a little girl in the sunflowers. There's a little boy behind the whatever that cart thing is. There's a little girl behind the ladder. And then Where's the fourth boy? Okay, so we gotta go. What does that say? Um, play and sink, find the children, find them within four hours. We ran into the children at Sunflower Grove. The children saw thugs. They, they'll they talk after I play hide and seek. Hold on, Earth. I also wanna save, because I mean, what happens if I don't do it like when I should? Little girl. She's not that way. Little girl. I like your pretty red dress. Where are you? Where's this though? I know I've got four hours, but still. Let's <laughs> pick stuff. <laughs> Can't take me four hours to find four kids. An hour a kid? There she is. I found her. Hi. There you are. He's so good with children. You found me. Oh, cute. My heart. I can't tell you that. That's cheating. My heart. Sorry. <laughs> Robot Rio malfunctions. Robot Rio cannot cheat. <laughs> um. Is it behind here? Yep. There's Bull Boy. <laughs> Bald boy. There you are. I like your t-shirt. <laughs> you found me. Oh, he's really creepy. Where are the others? Mm -mm. Nice try. You'll have to find him yourself. He looks like he tortures oh, bugs. Right. Sorry. Like ants with a magnifying glass. They pick on me for my glasses. I pick on them. And there was like a ladder. Is it like on the roof? Another ladder? Oh, there's a ladder over here. Ah! Rio! Robot Rio, can we... 
No? Hmm. Can we... Can you go all down there? There we go. Is he like... Oh, he's on the roof! There he is! Is that not him, or is that someone else? I was like... And there, there, there he is. Darn, you found me. Oh, she. She? Only one left. Where's the, where's the little one? Ask. Can we talk? Hi there. You see some kids. Mm Hi. -hmm. Did some kids pass by here? Uh... I'm looking for a kid dressed in blue. A red shirt? No, I said blue. A blue shirt. Ah, okay. A red skirt, you say? Ugh. Um, Old people. Excuse me. <laughs> You're not worth talking to. Let's ask her. Ways in. I need help with something. Are you speaking to me? Oh, um, what do you need? She's so cute. Did you see a kid dressed in blue? Oh, he just ran by. Ah, oh, perfect. Okay, thanks. Thanks. Uh, find the home. Found three children want to go. Find them in two hours. The Hong went down towards the river. Okay. Go down towards the river then. Yeah. Um. Where? I need help with something. What is it, mister? Help me. Did you see a kid dressed in blue? You're playing hide and seek, aren't you? Li Hong ran to that house over there. <laughs> okay, thanks. <laughs> These kids are really good at snitching. This house? Oh, oh it looks like a stonemason's house. I'm stuck. <laughs> Why has it got sinister all of a sudden? It's got a bit weird. This isn't good. This is not good. It got very sinister. All of a sudden. Robot Rio does not compute. Found you. Oh man. You oh man. Me. Now tell me about the thugs like you promised. I saw two strangers. They both went into this house. He's so what animated. Like? <laughs> into this house. One had a real smooth head with a spider drawn on it. Smooth. Must be the same ones that hit Joe and Wong's houses. Go join the others. Quickly. Okay, bye. Bye. Are we looking for clues? What the hell are they doing? We're gonna look for clues. I might be able to find out more about the thugs here. So we can find some clues. I don't mind saying it like that. Delirium. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Uh, Lin and Wailing saw Li Hong go into a nearby house, found Li Hong at Zhu's house. The thugs th uh, trash Zhu's house. Trash was only thrashed. Thrashed. But that looks like it should be trashed. Oh well. Zhu's house is in shambles. It must have been the thugs. Look for clues. Ooh. Let's open that. Hello? Oh, is, is that pictures? Take it! It's a photo. It's a photo. This might be a clue. Can I see the photo? Oh, found a picture of two men. And I'm stealing it! What's in here? Just some bricks and a hammer. What's this? 
Just some bricks and a hammer. This looks like stone, Rio. What's this? I don't think there's anything of interest. What's in here? There's some more knickknacks. Nothing of interest. Some fruit. Can we take the fruit? Looks good. Can we take it? Can we steal their fruit? We need all the food we can get, it's expensive. Why would you not take the fruit? <laughs> Why would you not steal? What's this? Just black. Just char. From cooking. Is there something in the pot? It's just water. It's just water. Chair. You just hop over it? Oh, he's gonna move it. <laughs> that makes more sense than just trying to hop over it, to be honest. I'm gonna squeeze past, but you could have actually like turned the table back round properly. I should look somewhere else. Then why do you let me look at it then? I wonder if there are any clues here. That normally means there are no clues here. Pots and pies. I should look somewhere. I shall look somewhere else. There's something under here. I'll try and like straighten this poor person's house back up. But I kind of feel sorry for him. What's a note? What's this? Some sort of name list? One of the thugs must have dropped it. This could be a clue. This could be a clue. It's always a clue. I should show the villagers what I found. They might be able to tell me more. Is that what we were looking for? We were just looking for that. I'm gonna keep like searching, but keep sleuthing around. Really, Nancy drew it. Rio. I should look somewhere. The Japanese Nazi Drew. <laughs> I should look. There might be something else in here. And I probably found the thing that I needed. What's this? Just like cups. <laughs> I found the thing I needed, but I'm just gonna look. Keep looking. Might find something else that's cool. You never know. Probably won't. <laughs> I wonder if there are any clues here. I wonder what know what's in that box. Any clues? Searching for clues. No clues. Searching for clues. No, I don't. That's not what I'm looking at. Anything in here? Just some wine. Is that wine or is it ink? I'm gonna go wine. Adults love wine. And like sheets, I don't know, some cloth. Oh, what's this? Ah, oh, can we take it? I what's want this? it. Maybe that kid from before dropped it? Guess I'll hold on to it for now. Oh, it's a forklift. Mine. 
<laughs> so funny. A forklift. <laughs> I love forklift racing. Picked up a toy forklift. Okay. I suppose you can't move, um... I should look some... I suppose you can't, like, move that. Ooh. I know I already did that. Let's get into bed. Maybe we can find clues if we get in his bed. I know, you're just gonna lift it up. Ooh. What could this be? A magazine? I've got no use for it. Why is there a magazine under his bed? Ew. Was it a dirty magazine? Did we just uncover Sue's dirty magazine? I think it's just tools and stone mason crap. I think we're done with the sleuthing here. Uh, it's like loads of stuff that maybe I missed, but who cares? <laughs> Found a piece of paper that looks like a name list. Perhaps the thugs dropped it. Uh, show what I found at Zoo House to the villagers. Um, Yuan Yushen, Shenwa's father, Zhao Kai Zhe, Zhe? Hmm? Village Square, Lin's father, Zhu Guwei. Stone Mason in the Sunflower Grove. Ke Jin Ho and is that Ye Yang Jin? Let's go find, see if we can find some information about these random guys. What's the bet? They're all stonemasons. Very possibly. Who should we go talk to? I'm gonna go talk to the there's like a woman. Look at the cows, the moo moos. I love cows. Hey, can I talk to you? I need help with something. That's not I how you talk to me. people. Oh, um, what do you need? Are you a martial artist by any chance? I am. I'm not very good. How did you know? I also practice, so I just had a feeling. <laughs> Bailu is widely known for its martial arts, so fighters from all over come to visit from time to time. I see. I see. Are you from Japan? Yeah. Yeah. Would you mind showing me some of your moves? Are we gonna fight a woman? Uh, you know how much I love I'd doing like that. To spar with you. Please. Sure. This ought to be good practice. It's true, I do need the practice. I'm very bad. <laughs> Yes. Need to get good at this. Need to get good at this. <laughs> I have such fat thumbs. Slow with a counter elbow attack. Assault, even. Punish the, that coat of inexperience to truly shine. Honestly, need to keep beating people up. Thank you so much. I learned a lot from you. She's so pretty. Come back if you feel like sparring again. I love how sure. lazy I too. It's kind of like so wonders. 
but she didn't actually help. I need help with something. You came back? Are you here to spot? Now's not a. I'm sorry, I. No, I'm. We st we wanted to talk to her. I need help with something. Are you speaking? Uh, name left. Here, look at this. Look at Is this. Is this a list of some kind? <gasps> really? Well, sorta. Sure, Guawe. I know that name. He's a stonemason that lives in this neighborhood. I don't know who the other ones are, though. I see. What's this red line? This one here that runs through Mr. Sure's name. That's a good question. I'm not sure. You haven't actually thought about that, have you? I need help with something. Are you speaking to me? Forklift. I want to return this someone's forklift. Here. Look at this. Leong had one of these. Look at this. He came by to oh, show Lee it Hong. off to me once. I knew it'd be Lee Hong. He's the boy who's always wearing a blue shirt. No. Okay. He loves blue. And can we ask I need help about with are you speaking the to picture? Me? Who are these people? Take a look is at there this. Anything you can tell me about this? Oh, this is Sir Guaway. He's Guaway. a stonemason that lives in this neighborhood. As for the other one? I've seen him before, but I don't know his name. Okay, thanks. Thanks. On that note, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will catch you in the next episode. Bye.